history, one history about the entertainment scene. One history about the entertainment scene. How important is the host at, at, at showcases? It's, it's very important, how you doing, know, brother? Very important. It's vital because we're the ones that presenting most of these artists to the stage sometimes for the first time. So yeah, we're the uh, some of the influencers that put these guys in the right position to set them up to look good and sound good on stage. And how much of it does it require for you to be an entertainer? Because if it's dead, then you got to entertain the crowd. So correct, how, correct. Yeah, sometimes you, we have to be comedic. Sometimes we have to, you know, move and shake the crowd and get the crowd hype and do all those certain things to uh, create an atmosphere for these artists to come out and have a great time to perform. And you know what? I had the pleasure of catching you at the Freak Deep concert before the Corona at um, Lakewood. Yes. You remember that? Yes. How, how was that experience? Uh, bringing on 22 acts in one night, it was, it was quite a bit. But yeah, but those are some of the guys, the underground guys and the on-top guys that performed through the Freaknik era way back like 92, 93, all the way up to, to the end. And then one last question. Uh -huh. Hip hop and violence. What do we need to do? To, what do we need to do to fix hip hop and violence? What do we need to do to fix it? Well, we don't need to do anything to fix it, but clean it up. Just clean some of it up. You know, some of the young artists didn't get the quite the right tutelage to learn how to be artists. They just became artists. So we need to just clean up some of it because some of those hip hop artists are influencing our kids. So that's pretty much all the basics I have. Just need to clean it up a little bit. Uh -oh, mojo. Yeah, mojo, Nelly. What's going on, bro? What's going on? How are you doing?